Good morning, good morning, good morning. Our devotional message scripture is coming from 1 Peter, the second chapter, and I begin at verses 4 through 10, and it reads as follows. To him coming as unto a living stone, disallowed indeed of men, but as chosen of God and precious, Ye also, as lively stones, are built up a spiritual house, a holy priesthood, to offer up spiritual sacrifices acceptable to God by Jesus Christ. Wherefore, also, it is contained in the scripture that, behold, I lay in Zion a chief corner stone, his elect, precious, and he that believeth on him shall not be confounded. Unto you, therefore, which believe, he is precious, but unto them which be of disobedient, the stone which the builder disallow, the same is made a, a head of the corner, and a stone of stumbling, and a rock of offense, even to them who stumbled at the word, being disobedient, whereunto also they were appointed. But ye are, the ch are, a, are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, a peculiar people, that ye should show forth the praises of him who has called you out of darkness into his marvelous light, which in time past was not a people, but are now the people of God, which has not obtained mercy, but now have obtained mercy. The title of the message is Jesus Christ, Our Sure Foundation. Let's look at it this way. Jesus Christ is the living stone. And yes, we know during his earthly ministry, he was rejected by many, but he was the chosen of God. And he is the precious of God because of who he is. He is God's only begotten son. That God sent into the world in human form to be a living sacrifice. He was the, he is the man a perpetuator, meaning he died on the cross, taking on man, sin death out of love, so that all who believe in him will have eternal life. And listen, it says, listen. And it says, all who believe are the lively stone that's building up God's spiritual house. Uh, we are a holy priest and we offer sacrifices that is acceptable God and that we die to self daily and present our bodies as a living sacrifices that is acceptable God. Now listen here. It says, and he, Jesus Christ, is the chief cornerstone, and every house has a headstone that wants um, the building the foundation, and each one uh, bricks in the foundation goes works from that. So Jesus being our foundation as believers, 
he is the head. Because we know this, the church was founded on the faith of Peter by Jesus Christ himself. And all who believe in Jesus Christ are those living stones. And verse 9 tells us who we really are. He says, but ye are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation. That means all who believe in Jesus Christ is part of God's holy nation of peculiar people that they look at, the world looks at us as being peculiar. But that's okay because we are precious in the eyesight of God, just as his son is. And being those peculiar people, listen, we have been called for a purpose and we shall, we give praises unto God who has called us. We are no longer in darkness and separated from God. We are now in fellowship with him and in union with Christ. But yes, we are a peculiar people because Jesus Christ is our sure foundation. Have a great day.